Stand by 30 seconds. This is shuttle launch control at T-minus two hours, five minutes, and holding. At the present time, the closeout crew has arrived in the white room uh, at the access arm leading to the orbiter. Astronaut Lauren Shriver is the astronaut support uh, pilot who is up there, and along with a uh, suit technician and two other mechanical technicians. They're in the process of donning breathing apparatus uh, preparing to go into the orbiter to assure that the proper mixture of oxygen is present there uh, for normal work. The purpose of the closeout crew is twofold. One, they put the astronauts into their seats and hook them up to the various instrumentation, their biomedical instrumentation, their life support uh, system in the orbiter. They also prepare the, the door for closing uh, remove all of the extraneous material from the orbiter and from that door area and prepare the access arm to be retracted prior to the launch. At the present time, at the present time, uh, back in the astronaut quarters, the crew is having breakfast at this time. They're having a traditional breakfast of orange juice, steak, eggs, toast, and coffee. They were awakened about 20 minutes ago when it was determined by Launch Director George Page that everything was going smoothly and that we were ready to proceed with the wake-up of the crew. Uh, after breakfast, they will be going into the uh, suiting room where the biomedical instrumentation will be attached and that they will put on their pressure suits. At the present time, everything going very smoothly, both at the pad and back at the astronaut quarters. This is shuttle launch control.
above all others. WDBO-FM, Stereo 92. Thank you for listening to Central Florida's most relaxing music on WDBO-FM, Stereo 92. We hope that when your listening needs require more in-depth news and information, you'll listen to our sister station, WDBO-AM, at 58 on your AM dial. Local and area news is covered by Central Florida's most respected news team. World and national news is reported by the ABC radio network. You get weather from our chief meteorologist, Dave McLaughlin. Sports with veteran sports director, Bill Stamper. Traffic information from Richard Shard. And on Wednesdays and Fridays, WDBO's critic at large, Tom Barry, reports on entertainment in the Central Florida area. For news and information, it's WDBO AM 58 on your AM dial. And for Central Florida's most beautiful, relaxing music, it's right here. WDBO FM, Stereo 92. When more beautiful music is produced, you'll hear it first on WDBO FM, Stereo 92. Stand by 30 seconds.